In this video, you will learn how to use easybib.com to create an MLA-8 citation. On the left-hand side of the screen are the steps that I will follow to create a sample citation. Before starting, you want to make sure that you have up the article that you're creating the citation for, as well as your works cited page, and easybib.com pulled up into your browser. The first step is to go down to the button that says, I only want to create citations and click. On the next screen, you will find a place for you to copy and paste the website of your source. So I'll go back to the article, come up to the web address in the browser, click Control C to copy, find the source bar, and control V to paste. Then click the orange cite button. This next screen is all about the website. So I'll look to make sure that the website that I, that I entered is the same as what EasyBib found. And then click the orange cite button. This screen shows what EasyBib was able to detect from the article. So we'll first take a look at what EasyBib found, the article title, the URL, the website title, the date accessed, and the date published. However, EasyBib did not find the publisher or sponsor. So now it is up to me to look back on my source, my article, and see if I can find that information. I'll click the orange continue button to the next screen. And here is where I will input that information. So looking back to my article, I see the title, I see the date it was published, the author, the actual content of the article. And then I'm going to scroll all the way down to the bottom of the page because that is typically where new information or other information can be found about the article. And here I see the publisher, Harvard Health Publishing. So I'll go back to EasyBib at this point and scroll down to where I see the publisher or sponsor. So here is the publisher or sponsor. input that information, double check that the other information is correct, and click the orange update citation. At this point, it's creating the citation. So I'll scroll, scroll down past the ads and find the MLA 8 citation. So from here, I'll highlight the citation, use control C to copy, come over to the works cited page, control V to paste, and I'll actually hit control shift V here to paste without formatting so that I keep my Times New Roman 12 point font. Unfortunately, the process doesn't end here because now my citation needs a hanging indent. A hanging indent looks like this. So I'll come back to the Works Cited page, come to the front of my citation on the second line because that's the part that needs tabbed, hit enter and tab to move it over. Come down to the third line, this time hit enter and come down to my fourth line and hit enter. And there you have a sample citation for MLA 8. 